Hello, welcome to Texture Math. In this session, we will learn about two more opcodes that is plist and param. So let's go through the program. So here we are writing the code in fixed format. So why we use this plist and param opcode? Suppose if you want to call this program from some other uh, program, then but in that case you want to pass some parameter to, to these program. So to pass the parameter, we will use this plist and param. So mainly this time here we are using this plist with star entry. So what it denotes, like it will take these parameters. So whatever the values we will pass here as a param means param, it will considered as an input parameter for this program. Okay. So on line number ten, I am using C spec. Then I am using opcode plist, and in plist I am passing factor one as a star entry so whatever the parameter i'm listing down below it will be considered as a input parameter for this program so if it doesn't uh, if this program is not called with those parameter then it will give some error it will not get executed because these are the mandatory parameter for calling this program so for the example here we are using uh, we are declaring one parameter as username so if you take f4 here so in operation you have to write param in result field you have to put that variable which you want to accept as a parameter and here on length you have to specify its length okay if you are passing if you are accepting numeric value then you can put decimal position otherwise you can uh, keep it as a blank okay so once this value is accepted after that we are just displaying it to the user so username is displayed and setting the set set on lr last record on so how we will call this program so i'm compiling it so firstly we will save it then compile it if i call it directly so it will give this error pointer or parameter error why because this time we are not passing any parameter but in program we are taking star entry we are using star entry it means we are accepting some parameter how much parameters only one because there are there's only one parm if there are two or three more lines with parm then it those parameter will also be required to call this but right now it requires only one parameter so how we will pass that in that case you will write call program name underscore param this is my program name then take f4 after f4 you can pass this parameter here so we are passing username as shermith in quotes because it is string and then hit enter so once you hit enter it displays that output how we will see that you can use call qcmd and call your program plist param f4 then pass your parameter shermet now press f10 so we displayed this value right so this is how you can use this you can directly call like this also call p list underscore param this is my program name then inside a bracket you can pass the parameter which is shermet and close the parenthesis it displayed this on the message uh, display program message right sharmit so that's how we can utilize this star entry or plist for accepting the parameter inside the program so if you are calling this program from some other program in that case uh, you you can you have to pass these parameter otherwise it, it will give the same error we have directly checked with the command line so you can also try like how to call this uh, with some other program so yeah for now it is that's all so yeah thank you for watching texture myth